Welcome to the channel, Attack Piano Player Kid. What is up everybody, the Tech Piano Player Kid here. And today I'm gonna to be showing you how to configure your TeamTalk server using PuTTY on Windows. In my last video, when I did how to configure your TeamTalk server on Mac, we did this all through the terminal command line. On this one, you have to use a third-party application called PuTTY. Again, I'm gonna advise you, if you do not know how to use the command line, I would not recommend doing this. But if you have messed with servers and know how to configure them using the command line, then you know what I'll be talking about here. Again, I'll be using some terminology in this video that you may not be familiar with. So let's go and start this. Start button. So, and I apologize for not the best audio quality for now. I don't have any other way of connecting this to my mixer, but once I get everything figured out, then we'll be good to go. So I'm gonna open PuTTY by using my shortcut command I created on my keyboard. Task, OTTY configuration dialog connection type, host name or IP address. That okay, so now that I'm going for the IP address and everything. Let's assume that you've already installed everything. You have the private key and everything configured correctly. Again, you know why you should never hand out the private key. If you do not know why, refer to my last video that I did with the one on the Mac. It's the same concept. So now we go to the list, and I'm going to go to my Team Talk server, and I'm going to do Alt L to load, and then I'll do Alt O. Okay, we are in. So now let's go ahead and do the same thing as we did before. Let's go ahead and check the server version by doing CD space TT. Enter. And now we'll do period slash TT5 SRV space dash dash version. And we'll hit enter on that, by the way. Now let's go ahead and learn how to shut down the server. These are the same commands that you'll be using as you did it on the Mac terminal. So to shut down the server, you will do kill all as one word, space dash u space the tech piano, uh, the username, sorry. And we'll hit enter. And now it's saying the remote, bleh, the remote server has unexpectedly closed by, by host, end of host, which is okay. We, we want to do that. So now it says inactive. Now I have to close PuTTY and reopen it, unless there's no way of doing this. Um, go back to my server, load it, open it, go back to CD space TT. Whoops. CD space TT. And now let's say I did some configurations and stuff. So we'll pretend we did that, add some user accounts and stuff like that, or change some settings like the file sharing. And now we will bring it back up. So now we will do period uh, slash, slash TT5 SRV space dash D. And there we go. It was the time, date, and the year, and 24 hour time and said the team stock server has been brought back up. And now when we're done all of that, we can do an exit command and enter and we're out of putty. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comments down below or send an email to the tech piano player kid at gmail.com. Remember to like comment, subscribe and turn on my post notifications and follow my Twitter at tech underscore piano. And with that in mind, I'll see you all later in the next video. God bless you all and peace. The Tech Piano Player Kid is out. Thank you for watching today's video. Please do not forget to subscribe, turn on post notifications, and leave a comment down below. If you have any questions, please email the Tech Piano Player Kid at gmail.com. Please also follow my Twitter at tech underscore piano.